History of the Jade Buddha Temple Shanghai China, The Statues, Historical Background and Architectural Features Subscribed by my YouTube channel, Golden Words History of the Jade Buddha Temple Dating from 1882 The Jade Buddha Temple, also known as the Yufo Temple, contains two Jade Buddha statues brought to Shanghai from Burma. The statues were given to the abbot Hugen after a visit to Tibet and Burma. On his return to Shanghai he built a temple with funds that had been donated for that task. The statues remained there until the uprising of 1911, which brought an end to imperial rule. The temple was destroyed during the revolution but was reconstructed on the same site during the period 1918-28, in the style of the Song dynasty, 960-1279. The statues were saved from the original temple and were brought back to the new one in 1928 when the new temple was completed. The statues are carved from white jade, one is the sitting Buddha which is 1.9 meters high encrusted with jewels and portrays the Buddha in meditation at the moment of enlightenment. The other is the reclining Buddha which is just under a meter long, it lies on a redwood bed and represents the Buddha at the moment of his death. The temple also has another reclining Buddha which is 4 meters long and was brought to the temple in 1989 from Singapore. Apart from being a temple it is also a Chan, Zen, Buddhist monastery, it consists of a number of main halls which are open to the public, these being the Tianwang Dian Hall which contains the statues of ferocious-looking deities known as the Four Celestial Kings, the Dashyong Baodian Hall which has three large gilded Buddha statues, the Buddhas of the past, by Sajya Guru, present, Sakyamuni, and future, Mithraya, surrounded with eighteen gilded Luohan statues. The third is the Jade Buddha Tower which houses the sitting Buddha, no photographs of that are allowed, it has two courtyards and at the sides are the Quan Yin Dian Hall, the Amitba Dian Hall, the Zen Tang Hall, and the recumbent Buddha Hall where the reclining Buddha is located. The temple contains many other statues and artifacts, not all of which are on display, while the walls are lined with around 7,000 Buddhist sutras. From the outside the temple is quite plain looking but inside it contains many beautiful items which make it one of the most popular tourist attractions in Shanghai. The Statues and Rooms of the Jade Buddha Temple One of the main attractions of the Jade Buddha Temple is the multiple statues that are displayed in the different halls and chambers. The Jade Statues of Buddha the Jade Buddha is one of the most important statues of the temple. The Buddha was carved out of white jade in a meditation position. The statue is located on a pedestal inside the Jade Buddha chamber. It is over six feet high and has a robe decorated with emerald and agate stones. There is a fee if you want to ascend to the room and see the statue. The other white jade statue, brought from Burma, is the recumbent Buddha. This is figure portrays Buddha lying on his right side and is about three feet long. Inside the temple, there is also a large reclining Buddha, made of marble, which is about twelve feet long. It was donated by Singapore. This statue is often confused with the recumbent Buddha statue. Jade Buddha Temple is a Buddhist temple situated in Shanghai, China. The temple was established in the late 19th century, initially housed two Buddha statues made up of jade which was imported from Burma. The statues are in sitting and reclining position. The statue with sitting position has the height of 1.95 m. In addition to this, the temple has larger reclining Buddha statue made up of marble. This statue was donated by Singapore. The Reclining Buddha The statues of the Chamber of Four Heavenly Kings Located inside the front hall of the temple, there is a collection of statues representing Buddhist figures. It consists of Mithraya the Bodhisattva, Skanda the Bodhisattva and the four heavenly kings. These last four figures represent the favorable circumstances wealth, wisdom, passion, and peace. The Statues of the Mahavira Hall In the grand hall of the temple, we find another collection of Buddhist figures. Three golden Buddha statues, Sakyamuni, Amitba and Medicine Guru, all of them over twelve feet tall. The gold statues of the gods of the twenty heavens. Eighteen arhats, which are small monuments dedicated to those that achieved enlightenment, 
the golden statue of Guanin and Sudana accompanied by their 53 masters. Historical Background of Jade Buddha Temple It was recorded that a Buddhist monk named Hugin set off for the pilgrimage to Tibet via Mtiwutai and Mtiame. After Tibet, he then visited Burma and was gifted five Buddha statues made up of jade by an overseas Chinese resident in Burma, Chen Junpu. Hugin then transported two of the statue to Jiangwan, Shanghai. The temple was then built with the help of donations. This temple was uprising during the early 20th century and later on, the statue was moved to Maigan Road. Later the Buddhist monk, Kachin also built new Buddhist temple with the support from Sheng Xuanhui, a senior official in the Qing Imperial Court. They built houses with thatched roofs at Ijou Pond by the Zhuanghuabang River in the northeast of Shanghai. The constructions took about 10 years, from 1918 to 1928. After completion, Kachin also invited Reverend Dixian from MTT on Tai to give a lecture on Buddhism in a grand ceremony. The people have observed various events in the temple complex. In 1956 BCE, Shanghai Buddhist Association organized the ceremony to celebrate the 2500th anniversary of the Buddha's enlightenment. Likewise, in 1966 BCE, during the Cultural Revolution, the monks made a living by selling handicrafts. In 1983, the Shanghai Institute of Buddhism was established at the temple under the Shanghai Buddhist Association. In 1985, after the return of the monk Zhizhi Xian and others from the trip, regular scripture lectures, meditation and other features of temple life was resumed. Architectural Features of the Temple The temple layout can be categorized into Chamber of Four Heavenly Kings, Grand Hall, and Jade Buddha Chamber. Chamber of Four Heavenly Kings This chamber is located on the southern edge of the temple. The Chamber of Four Heavenly Kings contains the statues of Mithraya Buddha, Skanda, and the Four Heavenly Kings. These icons represent favorable circumstances. Grand Hall The Grand Hall is also popularly known as the Great Hall which contains various statues in the different theme. The Grand Hall consists of statues of three golden Buddhas, Gautam Buddha, Amitbha Buddha, and the Bhisajayaguru Buddha. Among these Buddha statues, Gautam Buddha is placed in the middle while Amitbha is in the left and Bhisajayaguru is in the right. The hall also houses statues of gods of the twenty heavens which is glided with gold. These statues are placed on the eastern and western sides of the Grand Hall. The hall also houses statues of eighteen arhats which is also glided with gold and stands in two groups of nine. The other statues are the statues of Guanin, Sudana, and his fifty-three teachers. The statue of Guanin stands at the northern entrance to the Great Hall and statue of Sudana is placed next to Guanin. The statues of the fifty-three teachers have placed above of them. Jade Buddha Chamber this chamber housing Jade Buddha statue is located in the northern section of the temple of the second floor. This chamber houses Jade Buddha statue which was imported from Burma. The chamber also houses additional Buddhist sculptures. Other interior areas Besides the display of statues, the temple also features a variety of areas. There is a public restaurant area with an independent entrance from the street. The hall at street level serves noodle dishes, and another, and a more elegant restaurant is located upstairs. Both halls are accessible to the general public. In the southernmost part of the temple, there is a pool with fish that can be fed by the visitors.